Welcome back to the channel guys, Crypto Lightsaber back again with another video and I want to talk about Uni. Obviously we talked about Uni yesterday, you can see I did a video saying that it was going to break out. Okay, some people might not have believed it, but um, I did have a pattern drawn out on the chart. As you can see, yesterday we had a descending triangle and we actually got a breakout. It was poking its head above that level. We didn't have much volume at the time, but it has still, um, it did still poke its head out and it has started moving to the upside as you can see we are way up now from where i posted the video okay we're looking at over 30 percent at this point if we just go from um at the time of recording okay so um yeah that's a nice move there from uni the uni token okay now i'm actually out of this at the moment and um, got to know when to take profits okay because i do have a resistance line up here now i did get out a little bit early okay because you never know what can happen in these markets all right guys until we get a close above this level potentially and we see that continue to the upside i will be sitting on the sidelines um at the moment okay only because i strongly believe that in order to sustain this move upwards we need to see a pullback all right we've got a mini parabolic curve type formation happening there okay now i could be wrong and this could just break through my line of resistance up here which could be moved up slightly actually and it could just break through that line and just carry on to the upside um at that point i wouldn't have lost money because i've taken profits okay but i could potentially uh, re-enter up in those levels and that's only if we see this volume increase okay because this volume i mean you can see the volume is increasing i would like to see a nice big push to the upside if i was to take another position i would even consider putting a stop limit to open that order potentially all right guys but i haven't decided on that yet you can see and we are on a one hour chart by the way okay um i have been trading the smaller time frames on this because it paints a better picture because there's not a lot of chart history okay so you can see the RSI is in overbought territory at the moment and the MACD is still in a good place and there's still a long way up that it could go but that is not guaranteed you can see the momentum has shifted to the upside it hasn't really broken that level too much before you can see over there it did but it could just roll back over and come for a cool off period um, which is what I would prefer to see at this point in time. Sorry for you guys if you are still holding this and you'd like to see it just go straight through that and make some quick money. But this is a move that um, is not going to happen overnight, in my opinion. Okay. Um, so, yeah, let's just go up the uh, time frame, move to the four hour. All right. As you can see, um, we do have quite a large couple of candles there all right guys and like i said we've got that resistance line over here okay the rsi does look like it does still have some way uh, where it could go up and the macd has got a bullish cross and the momentum shift has finally come to the upside on that but like i said i'd much rather wait for a potential rejection and a pullback however far that can come down okay as long as it puts in a higher low anywhere in this area it's still kind of bullish and we'd have to wait and see whether another move to the upside can be achieved with the uni token now the reason i like to take profits is because through my experience doing this for years you know there can sometimes be a lot of disappointment um, when you're expecting a certain price point you have to kind of make up your own mind and kind of play it smart especially when there's a lot of youtubers out there with price predictions if you know anything about me i don't do price predictions but i did kind of signal in my telegram group that i, I you could potentially see this go up to about five dollars and fifty cents and that's only potentially all right guys so if you're hanging on for another you know let's let's do a measured move from here okay if you're hanging on for another five percent that can be quite a lot of money depending on how much you've got put down on this but for me it's personally it's not worth um taking the risk at the moment locked in those profits okay and um yeah i'm waiting to see what else can happen for the uni token all right so yeah 
I mean, guys, let me know in the comments um, if you're still holding this or whether you think I'm wrong, whether you think it's going to just blast through to the upside, take out the previous high about $8.60 and then carry on to $10, $15. You know, uh, there is potential for that at the end of the day. But um, this is a new token, guys, and um, still not a lot of people are clued up on what the utility is. For example, you know, they've got the governance and um, liquidity, you know, you can do farming and all that sort of stuff. Obviously, Uniswap have just jumped on the hype. It makes sense for them to capitalize on this. And um, there's other coins coming out trying to take their place. At the end of the day, um, they could, they've took a, taken a strong market share from this. All right. And um, yeah, only time will tell whether this will follow the likes of BNB's, uh, uh, Binance Coins BNB. All right, guys, but um, a lot of people have comparing it to comparing it to that. Um, I mean, one thing that attracted most people to the BNB token is straight out the gate it had utility, and um, you can basically use it to offset your trading fees uh, by fifty percent. Uniswap is not offering that kind of thing. Okay, so um, there probably be a lot less of a reason to hold the Uniswap token. The only reason I would say. Um, that they will be good to hold the token is for price appreciation and um governance you know if if and and you know you obviously there's you've got the, the mining the farming okay but you're not going to get any trading discounts from that okay and if you're the biggest exchange in the world like binance for example and um you know you're giving a 50 percent trading discount for people using the token there's more of a reason to hold that and hence why we've seen the price increase on that for the longer term all right guys but i could be wrong and uniswap could be the next you know hidden gem that you know rules them all all right guys but moving on let's have a look at um just a quick look at tomo chain all right this was signposted to me by a member of my group um shout out gareth robson um uh, when he pointed it out, he said that there was coming. It looked like there could be a breakout over in this section over here. Okay, he's absolutely right. Um, what we can also see, um, which I pointed out, is we've got a W, um, um, a double bottom. Okay, and it's also a W shape. So we've got a double bottom. Okay, and we've got the increase in volume. All right, guys. So you know, in the longer term, I would expect this to continue to the upside. Obviously, he's taken out this level. Um, ever so slightly at the moment okay but this is one of them charts where it's not going to happen overnight okay this would be a midterm hold if you are looking to get into this but as you can see you are getting that curved shape to the upside all right now where could we see a potential price target on this okay you're always going to look for the previous um, support or resistance level all right and in this case we're looking at we, we we're looking left okay so we're looking at the previous support all right so if we bring it over here you're looking you can see um on average this would be the support and resistance level for this coin at the moment okay you can see it found a little bit of a struggle over here broke down came back up once it broke out of that it came all the way back up there it came down bounced off that level came over and once it came back under there it rolled all the way down to there so that's the target i would say in the short term that we're looking at for tomo chain all right guys so that is at 0.9 two and bearing in mind i'm only looking at usdt pairs at the moment especially with the uncertainty in the btc market if btc goes down it's going to drag the btc pairs down with it the usd pairs have much more of a chance to thrive while btc is going down all right guys so if we look at that that would be potentially a 14 percent move just in the short term but you know with this double bottom shape i do expect that potentially even if it does get rejected off that level it's probably going to come back up and retest it and it's going to break through and if it does break through there could be a larger scale move on this chart to the upside that's tomo chain all right guys so keep an eye out for that one that one's for free okay i'm not saying this is um 100 definitely going to happen all right but there is the potential there and i've given you the reasons why okay so if it doesn't don't turn around and start leaving hate comments all right guys let's go with probability all right and um you know the good thing about finance is you can put a stop limit okay so if you do make an entry or you can uh, all you have to do is just go to the previous 
um, low point all right and put a stop limit underneath that level all right sometimes it's better just to bring it down a little bit further but you do um, increase the chance of losing a little bit more of a percentage on your position by doing that all right guys but let's just be careful and protect our capital manage our risk in situations like this when we've got um, you know the, the whole markets are going red and going down to the ground all right guys and yeah that's all i've got for you for now really all right if you're not subscribed to the channel please subscribe get on the twitter and follow me over there at crypto lightsaber with a l-y-t instead of a l-i-g-h-t in lightsaber all right guys like leave a comment down below and i'll see you guys in the next video if you would like to support the channel there's actually a way you can do that now while getting something out of it for yourself we have a new clothing brand called parabolic this is a brand dedicated to the crypto space I use the name Parabolic because that's the kind of movement we like to see in those charts. Now there's a range of products you can choose from, from hoodies, vests, socks, even face masks during this pandemic time. And we're using a lightsaber to represent the YouTube channel. Okay, there'll be a link in the description so you can go and check that out. Got a range of different colors, range of different products, all right? And what I'll actually be doing is for the first 100 people that do actually buy something, if you send me a message, what I'll do is I'll send you a free invite for the new telegram group which will be a paid telegram group okay after that okay so the first 100 people you will get a invite sent to you for free all right even if you buy something as small as a mug you will get that just to show my appreciation for your support as well okay guys so you've got a chance to be the exclusive members of the new group you've also got a chance to get your hands on some exclusive merchandise so link in the description get on over to the website and make your purchase now remember trend is your friend.